You are not Nigerian's voice. Tinibu knocks NLC over strike. Hey, <laughs> my people, this is very serious. When I don't hear this one, this is the latest news for today. You are not Nigerian's voice. Tinibu knocks NLC over strike. Over strike. This is our president talking about the Nigerian Labor Congress who have been threatening to go on strike. You know, last week or so, they went on strike and let it call it off. They also have been threatening to go on strike over the situation in the country. Since over nine months that the president has taken over, nothing is moving. So many things are going wrong and hardship is everywhere, hunger is everywhere. And the NLC wanted to go on strike. But look at the response of our president to the Nigerian Labor Congress. You are not Nigerian's voice. Tinibu, not uh, NLC over strike. My dear people, welcome to, Niger welcome to Morin's Entertainment TV, where we bring you news about politics and entertainment and everything. Today, we want to look at the reaction of this president presidential speech to NLC. How do you see it? My dear people, look at the country we are in. We conducted the election. The last election was one of the best elections we had in Nigeria. And we hope that whatever the outcome of the election is, whether, we, whether positive or negative, it will be to the good of Nigerians. They did it as they did. We don't know. We kept quiet. But look at what is coming out now. After nine months, hunger everywhere. After nine months, no job. After nine months, so many things are going wrong. People are dying of hungry. And NLC, in their own way, we, me and you know, say NLC, know they do well. They always use their strike to threaten government in order to collect money. We know that. But at least everybody knows that in every country where things are not going on well, NLC has to stand up, either to go on strike or either to demonstrate or to just because they must have a voice over what is happening in the country because they are the people who pinching because they are the, 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 the workers. Now, they just threatened the president, the, 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 the government that they want to go on strike. But look at what our president is telling them. Look at what the president is telling them. He said, you are not Nigerian voice. If NLC is not Nigerian voice, who is the Nigerian voice? NLC is part of the masses. NLC is part of the masses. He said, Tinimbu, who stated this at an unveiling, uh, unveiling of phase one of the Lagos Rail Mass Transit Red Line at the Ikeja station, declared that the NLC was not the voice of Nigerians and should contest in the 2027 general election if it was interested in joining electoral politics. Can you imagine? We are talking about hunger. We are talking about hardship. And Tinibu, after nine months, is talking about 2027 election. Do you see the problem? Do you see the problem? We are still talking about hunger. We are still talking about how the masses, how the youth, how the, 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 the common people in Nigeria can eat. Tinibu is talking about Nigerian election of 2027, which means he's done with Nigeria for this time. He's just waiting for the next time, the second term. So that is the situation. Can you now see the nature of the leaders we have in Nigeria? Can you see the spirit? Because we always say it, that we will need to elect people. We need to elect people that will carry our mind, carry our cases in their mind. But look at the situation now. NLC wants to go on strike. Personally, I support NLC to go on strike. I don't know about you. I will support them to go on strike so that let's see whether something can be done out of this issue. Protests are going everywhere. Have you ever seen the president address the nation over the protest, the hunger protest that's going on? Have you heard him say anything about it? Why should we have people who only threaten us instead of caring for us? That is the situation in Nigeria. That is how we see it. We'll continue to manage them. The president says, that the labor union has gone on strike four times within his nine months in government, that that record is not good for him. Yes, we know. It is not a good record that the NLC had gone on strike four times in nine months. But come to think about it, they didn't just go on strike four times in nine months. If you had done something, call the NLC together and had a meeting with them as you come in as in government, and you discuss with them as it will be. How will they not be going on strike? It means that they were neglected. Going on strike means creating awareness. And all of us know, say, NLC know they do well. We know. But in this kind of situation, that's not why the president should be threatening them and start talking about the election, whether they will join him in the election. My people, that is how we see it this time. I just want you to go to the comment section and comment what the, 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 the president said, how you see it. He said, you are not Nigerian voice. Tinibu knocks NLC.
overstrike. Tinimbu knocks NLC over strike. You are not Nigerian voice. Because his problem is that NLC has gone on strike four times within his administration of nine months, which is not very okay for NLC to do that. But also, everybody knows that it is in the thing they pinch, as if they pinch dick, now you they pinch Harry. As if they touch you, now you they, he said, use your place, know how another place, another person, oh, there. Now, so it be now. I say, make I just bring the gist for now, so that we touch light it and see how it did. Well, I'm waiting to see your comment on the comment section. If you have not subscribed to our channel, please go ahead and subscribe. And if you're, if you're, you know your friends that you, you know, you need to share with them and so that we can go wider to bring entertainment to you. Thank you. Thank you for today.